Hi, I'm Lucent. I'm from Hong Kong and I'm a senior studying informatics. Hi everyone, I'm Ria from Mumbai, India. I'm a junior studying marketing, digital and social media applications with a minor in psychology. Hi, my name is Srishti Goyal. I am a junior at Indiana University. I'm doing a major in finance from Kelly School of Business and I'm originally from New Delhi, India. As a college town, I would describe Bloomington as very diverse and very artistic. Coming to Bloomington was definitely the calm that I kind of needed in my life and I feel for an undergraduate choice it's a very excellent choice because you kind of like experience the whole campus environment here which is not kind of possible if you go to a big city for your uh, education. So I think my favorite thing about Bloomington is the size because it is small enough to feel like home but there's always something new that you can do. I also love the weather because you get to experience all the four seasons which is pretty rare in US I would say. I think one of the most unpredictable yet exciting parts of Bloomington is its weather. This is a time you kind of like get to experience all the seasons. My favorite is fall and I love when the trees are like different colors. So the pro tip here is to kind of wear layers. Always wear layers so that you can kind of get rid of some clothes while uh, you're in class but as soon as you go out you can kind of like pull them back. For everyone, who, anyone who wants to try new foods and explore their kind of palate, Bloomington offers a range of cuisines. Fourth Street is specifically well known for its diverse cuisine. I think when everyone comes back for their fall or spring semester, Bloomington comes alive and all the people who live here, they get excited, all the students get excited. And just because of that, there's a lot of happening around the campus, happening around the city. We have a lot of like art festivals and music festivals. One example I would give is definitely the Lotus Music Festival. It's an annual festival that encompasses a range of different cultures and a lot of kind of multilingual and diverse musical performances. There are also ways to enjoy performing arts outside of the annual festival. And one example I would give is the Buzzcock Theatre. It's specifically for the local community and I think students can definitely enjoy some really great performances at a very affordable price. I think the best thing about the campus and the natural resources that we have available, like everything is within the walking distance, that if I want to go somewhere, it maximum takes like a 20 minute walk. And I think it's beautiful because it's a lovely walking spot. You can walk anywhere across campus, anywhere in the city I feel, and it's beautiful. There's Griffey Lake, and there's like a forest surrounding it that you can go and hike. And within campus, it's really a green area. It's fun, like getting to see all the deers, all the squirrels. Squirrels have an Insta page. I think like while you're coming from Indiana Falls to Bloomington, you'd see like all farms around and you'd be like, oh my God, where am I actually heading? <laughs> but I feel like once you come here, it's true that it's best of both worlds because there are quiet spots on campus. There are multiple like libraries and places where you can study and kind of like zone out when, it, when you have exams or something coming up. But at the same time, there is this downtown Bloomington area and the Kirkwood Street especially, which is filled with restaurants and like even nightclubs and pubs. Like you know where to go if you want to have fun and you know where to go when you kind of need to uh, study and have that quiet time. I think it's a very diverse town because I believe Bloomington has something in store for everyone, regardless of where you come from or where your origin is.